Hello and welcome back to another video on Diablo 4. So we went over this a couple days ago when they mentioned the cow level and the campfire. And I noticed there's been a lot of reaction to that. There's a lot of people who are just nerding out trying to find the the information on the cow level. So there's this Discord. Uh, it's called Not Finding a Cow Level. And I'll put that in the link to the description below. But they found an unknown quest, a quest called Named Unknown. Uh, we, we know about the existence of a quest named Unknown that leads to the cow level. This requires... So the quest supposedly is named Unknown. This is all data mined information and just stuff they found within the game uh, from lots of hours, it looks like, of exploring. Uh, so the, just to, to get this quest, you have to find three relics uh, that are random drop uh, with certain conditions that we don't know yet. Uh, we'll talk about this in a little bit. It's uh, some type of event um, with a really low drop chance. All right, so uh, relic one, a bloody wooden shard uh, is dropped uh, from both Hevazer and Kedjistan, okay? And then the second relic, the musty tome, is a droppable from Skull's Glen or Fractured Peaks. Okay, so it looks like we're gonna have to be traveling to each different zone for each item uh, And then the third one is a metallic metallic fragment uh, It's just from dry steps, uh, but potentially requires a hell tide uh, To be confirmed so they haven't confirmed this yet whether or not you have to do this event during the hell tide or not So they're gonna confirm that later uh, And then it's speculated that you are to cleanse them at the fountain at the uh, Ked Badu city at the Dry Steps. So that's the main city in Dry Steps. And then cleansing all three of them should trigger a secret key drop. And this secret key drop, we are assuming that it unlocks a secret cellar uh, known as the Forlorn Hovel, okay? If you remember from Diablo 2 II and 3, uh, this is the, you know, cow level pretty much. Uh, question mark probably perform a ritual that will open the portal So that is the current quick summary of what they have gathered and let me show you So it's assumed that this is going to be a cellar and the key is going to unlock this house here uh, And for some reason while I'm standing here these dead cows uh, These cows just spawn and then die next to me <laughs> And uh, it's kind of weird. So they're just kind of stacking up where I am. So let me go ahead and show you where I am. So it's speculated that this is a cow head. Okay. This is the shape of a cow's head. Uh, you know, eye, the nose, etc. And the cabin slash cellar, secret cellar, is supposedly located where I'm standing now. So my map's not fully revealed. Uh, this was my alt, and now it's my main. So we're in Skullskin. And this is the under the fat goose in teleport and then here is where I'm standing So for some reason, I don't know uh, These cows keep spawning here, and it's kind of funny and uh, They just keep falling over and dying. So let's go back into the discord real quick. So They've tried so many different things there. There's uh, Gaspar he's just like some rare random elite that walks around uh, they've tried to leash him. They, they've tried to drag cows to him. Uh, you know, they wore rare items, killed them, stuff like that. Uh, none of that worked. And then, uh, have you thrown them into the fountain? You know, uh, they've done emotes to the fountain. They've offered ears to the fountain. Uh, they've done stuff with the statues around here. Have you tried wearing a full set of them and killing a cow king? Cows, uh, yeah, they... Uh, supposedly they say later here they've killed hundreds of cows some of the members in this discord and they haven't triggered anything uh, Have you tried emoting at the cows with them equipped? Uh, now they're talking about the fountain. Uh, this is a supposedly the fountain where you are going to cleanse the three relics that we mentioned before uh, Have you put ears into it? Uh, I'm assuming they mean PvP ears and yes, they tried that uh, Have you put all the super rare items into it? Yes, and we emoted uh, so that didn't work either. Have you tried luring cows? There's no cows close enough. They reset pretty small distance. We have tried the dogs <laughs> uh, Have you tried 
dying at the fountain we have tried using pvp scroll and teleporting but we haven't managed to die in town at the fountain <coughs> have you tried killing uh insert thing here in the fountain you cannot attack in town so there's no way to do that that we have thought of have you tried killing monsters with super rares equipped and throwing into the fountain yes other have you tried killing all the cows on the map yes we tried killing a lot of cows many people have tried killing some cows a few people have killed hundreds of cows uh i mean i'm not killing them they're just killing themselves so i'm just uh just standing here letting the cows kill themselves i don't know what they're doing so uh then there's a bunch of just information they have uh you know just throughout the discord and it's just it's just really cool to see all these nerds uh geeking out about the um cow level and uh some of these guys are very knowledged within this realm they know a lot and they have data mined and researched and uh they've they've done uh research on like markings within the game they've done and in, in, insane things uh let me see like they they they're going around like dungeons finding random markings in dungeons oh is this marking mean something oh uh, here's the rare mob that they try to leash uh yeah they 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 they're investigating like everything uh and again i'll put this uh discord in the description below so you guys can check it out yourself uh So there's some kind of an event uh, focused on Hauser and Kajistan to receive our first threat. However, it's well known that their other two zones, Dry Steps, Skulls Glen, and Fractured Peace, are also likely to drop two and three, Relic two and three, if we knew what that event was. So they don't know exactly what the event is. Um, whatever this event is, we need to complete it to drop the appropriate Relic. The event should be identical in all three of these regions. Uh, put practically, we can assume that looting the corpse of the druid is not a possible event, as we could only ever do that in Scots Glen, where they do spawn eternally. A silent chest makes an excellent contender, as they will spawn and act the same in every zone. Okay, so silent chest. I will primarily point out that this is not a very efficient method of finding which event we should run, but rather an extremely efficient method to determine which events we will be wasting our time grinding. For clarity, when we say event, we are not referring to things named events in the actual game. Events are just sequences of actions or sometimes even just one action in which uh, accumulate in an outcome. So he's not talking about like uh you know like the events that spawn with the red the red circles like there's one over here. Um he's not talking about those events. He's talking about like for example, if I come over here and like loot this body, right? It'll trigger like for ex this is just an example. Like if you loot this body, it'll op it'll spawn three cows. That that's the event they're talking about. They're not talking about an actual like event, right? So like if I break one of these things, right? Like that that's the event they're talking about. So they're not talking about an actual like event like within the game. So it's speculated they're speculating that there's going to be an event. They don't know whether it's gonna be within Helltide or without Helltide. Uh so and it's gonna when this event happens, uh you're going to have a five percent chance of getting the actual relic that's needed. And you're going to need three of these relics. So they're trying to figure out what these events are, what triggers the events, and how to get the relics and where exactly those relics are attainable. And uh, so that's pretty much what we know about the cow level so far. And yeah, that's that's it. I just wanted to share this with you. I'll put uh, the Discord link in the description below. And guys, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. really helps. And also hit that like button. Any questions or comments, leave them below and we'll get back to you. Thanks for watching. Y'all have a good one. Peace.